best NBA Jam player in the world right here. Now, some of you guys out there, I know you always say to yourselves, you say, no, I'm the best in the world. I'm the best in the world. I'm sure there's a lot of you out there watching right now that say, I'm not, this kid's the best NBA Jam player in the world. No, no, I'm the best NBA Jam player in the world. How can it be? Only for Sega Genesis, original Sega Genesis, NBA Jam regular, not TE. I'm not claiming to be the overall NBA Jam champion of the world. NBA Jam, Sega Genesis, career undefeated. It says I have four losses. It's because in third grade, a kid borrowed my game and played under my name and lost four times. I'm technically 153-0. I have four career shutouts to my name. 208 to nothing, 212 to nothing, 204 to nothing, and 217 to nothing. Those are my four career shutouts. With a partner, I've scored over 250 points. If anybody else that out there can match those credentials, you tell me, right? So right now, here, we're going to play a game. San Antonio Spurs. Doesn't matter who they throw against me. It really doesn't. It just doesn't matter. It's going to be too easy. It's going to be too easy. Too easy. Got to be David Robinson, obviously. Best player in the game, D Rob, David Robinson. Got to get on fire first, obviously. I mean, strategy is strategy. Yeah, John Stockton. Try to shoot that three again, I dare you. Yeah, maybe on a Tuesday. Now I'm on fire, now it's a wrap. Oh, oh, come catch me, Carl. Nope. Not happening tonight. Not happening tonight, baby. Oh, 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 trying to trick me. Not happening. I know some of you might be saying, that's goaltending. That's goal. No, 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 that's the game, so that's how I play it. Come see me if you want. They had an NBA Jam Sega Genesis World Tournament. There's no way I'm not winning. How am I not winning? Not winning. Now, I'm not guaranteeing a shutout right now. Shutouts are very, very rare and very hard. Computer's way too gimmicky to shut out every single time. But I'd love to see if anybody out there can respond to this video with a video of them beating the computer by a better score. I would love to see it because I don't believe it's even possible. Respond to me. Hook, hook me up with your email. We can get together and play a little one-on-one -on -one if you want to. Humans can't beat me. Got a couple stories. I'm in college. One night, we're over at the uh, we're over at the dorm. A bunch of guys hanging around talking. And obviously, everybody used to play NBA Jam when they were kids. It was the best game of all time in 1993. Sitting there, one kid goes, "Yo, you remember NBA Jam?" And I was like, "Of course I remember NBA Jam. I have it in my room right now, and I'm the best in the world." He goes, "No, no, no. you're not the best in the world at Sega Genesis." And I go, "No, no." Only Sega Genesis, I'm the best in the world. And he goes, no, no, there's no way. And I'm like, all right, I'll bet you $100 right now that I beat you at NBA Jam. He goes, wow, that's the easiest $100 I've ever made. I proceeded to beat him by 47, and he cried all night. You cheated. You blocked the whole game. No, I'm good. That's what it's called. Don't cry about it. Learn how to play. What Tiger, is it? Tiger's two under, by the way. He just had three straight birds. Tiger Woods is two under. Not that anybody else out there cares. I can technically play this game and watch something else. That's how easy it is to, for me. Computer's a joke. Zoom in on the score next time, though. My only challenge right now is to shut the computer out. It might not happen. It might, you know. Who cares, though? Either or, I'm still the best in the world. Schwap! He's on fire. And yes, I do talk a lot of smack to the computer. If you don't talk a lot of smack to the computer, then I don't know why you're playing. Schwap. Let's go, Carl. Come get some. Oh, come on. Oh, you're killing me. All the passing kills me. It's scoring now 48 to 2. All right. Not, not one of my best quarters of all time, but I'll take it. I'll take it. Not one of my best, but I'll take it. Here we go. Another thing I want to comment on is if you're watching me play this entire game, what's wrong with your life? <laughs> if, you, if you're watching the middle of this game right now, yeah, you, <laughs> there's something wrong with your life. <laughs> if you're actually watching 10 minutes of somebody else playing NBA Jam. If you are watching, you better be taking notes at least, right? I mean, you got to learn from the best. I'm back on. Back in Fuego, let's go. I'll explain my methods to all of you. You want my methods? Middle, 
find the middle of the lane, time it with the turbo jump perfect. My three-point method is run down the bottom, a quick stop on a dime, let the defender roll by, pop the three, because otherwise you get blocked sometimes. You can't just go with a straight up, but you want your guy there, and you want to let him go all the way to the baseline and pop the three. See, watch, Carl's with me. Nope, not anymore. That's probably one of the most high percentage three-point shots when you're on fire that there is in the game. It's also, oh, I got pushed. That was a push. But you know what? That's how it goes sometimes. Boom, shot the lock. I'm sure I'm going to get to 100. And we're not doing this with any repeats, right, Dylan? No repeats, right? Alex, any repeats? Nope. Nope. Real thing, authentic. First try, I'm not going to sit here and play until I shut somebody out. I'm going to show you just an average game of NBA Jam for me. This is me by myself playing NBA Jam. I'd even be below average. I usually hold the computer to somewhere around 5 to 10. So 6 in the first half. I'm, I'm a little bit a little bit pissed right now that they've scored 6 points on me. One was up, two were on a push, though. Sometimes they push you, you just can't control it. No biggie, though. No biggie. Let's see, what, what's our time and score situation here? Minute. Got 76. I'm on fire with a minute left. I want to try and get six threes up in this time. So I want to try and score 18 more points before the end of this quarter. Let's count them. That's one. Need quick threes. Good job. That's one. That's two. Need four more. Ah. Oh, good block. That wasn't even me blocking it. That was Sean Elliott. What's that, three? I need three more. Three more to meet my goal. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Plenty of time. Plenty of time. Two more. Two more. If I can get to 94 out of this, that's pretty salvaged. I'll just have to have a big second half. Here we go. Bang, bang. Oh. Killing me here. Killing me. Four, three, two, one. Let's go! Count it. 94 to 6, below average half for me, i got to say. I'm usually happy if they only score 2 or 4. 2 or 4 is a good half. We're going to cut off right now. We're going to come back for the fourth quarter because we only have a couple minutes left here. We'll be back for the fourth quarter to show you the wrap-up of the game, all right?